This is the Iowa Weather Report for Wednesday, August 20th, 2014. And now our first look at the Zero Z GFS model run. At 1 p.m. this afternoon, we have one system moving through the Great Lakes. Another moving into Southern California. We have a trough digging in across the north and west. With that system moving through the Great Lakes, it'll be bringing a frontal system close to the state. Some showers and thunderstorms will be possible, mainly over the western counties early in the day, and then in the Dakotas later in the day, some severe weather is possible. That will move through the state later tonight into the early morning hours of Thursday. You can see here by midday Thursday, we should see maybe a shower around, but otherwise mainly sunny skies. Highs today and tomorrow will be mainly in the 80s to lower 90s. It'll be very humid. Heat indices well into the 90s. Friday, we'll see some showers around. Best chances at this point for the next couple of days look to be during the overnight into the early morning hours. Can't rule out an isolated afternoon shower or storm. Saturday, it looks like we'll likely be the driest day as most of the precipitation will be way into Minnesota and Wisconsin. Can't rule out anything north of about Highway 20, even on Sunday as well. It's all going to depend on this ridge that's to our south where there's no precipitation. If that's it edges further north, that could take a lot of this precipitation out of the state. You can see as we move into the new work week on Monday, there's a low pressure center over Manitoba, a cold front swinging in from the north and west, showers and thunderstorms moving into the state here on Monday. But then as we move ahead to Tuesday, that front stalls as that low begins to move up to the northern or northwestern part of Quebec in Hudson Bay, that front kind of stalls out over the state. That means showers and thunderstorms will be possible. And you can see even by next Wednesday, this trough is trying to dig in. This ridge to the south is really keeping hold. It's kind of being shunted to the north and east. You can see a possible tropical system in the southwestern gulf. That's something we may have to watch. And this front trying to force its way south from the high pressure to the north, the ridge to the south, and the tropical system over the Gulf of Mexico. We have several days to watch it. Speaking of that tropical system, as we go into the extended period, you can see it moves ashore in southeast Texas or southwest Louisiana, according to the GFS. Big ridge over the south and west. Main storm track well to our north. You can see that tropical system around Houston, Galveston. You can see showers and thunderstorms all over the southeast coast. High pressure over the Great Lakes. And with the storm track well to the north, that means temperatures will likely be in the 80s or so. And going into the end of the forecast, September the 4th, you can see pretty much a wavy pattern across the northern tier of the country. Ridge over the southern part of the country around Louisiana or so. Any showers and thunderstorms will be very widely spaced. Best chances look to be over the southeast and across the northern Rockies, with temperatures likely starting to edge up as we go into the beginning of September. But the satellite image from last evening is showing a little bit of an edge of some thunderstorms across the plains, some over the eastern Great Lakes into the Ohio Valley, across the south, and the monsoonal flow continue, continuing over the southwest. The watch warning map shows the flash flood watch over southeastern Arizona around Tucson or east of there into New Mexico. Heat advisories over far south Texas. An excessive heat warning around St. Louis, but fairly quiet elsewhere. The QPF chart doesn't show it's going to be very quiet in all places. This is rainfall through Sunday evening at 7 o'clock, showing rainfall amounts could be between 1 and 3 inches across the Dakotas into Minnesota. This may move into Iowa. We'll have to see. We could see some amounts around that as well.